Don't think I want to know what happened next. <laughs> oh, stop. He wasn't so drunk as not to figure it out. Besides, men don't interest me. I told him that from the start. Luckily, Dandelion's an open-minded fellow. We had a lovely evening. He became a loyal customer afterwards. Dandelion visit your shop often? I tried many times to talk him into a decent doublet. <laughs> Sadly, he'd only come in to get a button reaffixed or a hole patched. When did you last see him? Some time ago. He brought in one of Zoltan's jerkins, insisted I sew on an extra pocket. Odd as requests go, I had the distinct feeling he'd actually come to talk. What did you and Dandelion talk about? He asked about anything in particular? Hmm, let me think. Had an ordinary chat, really. Although, indeed, he did keep asking about Kalkstein. If Dandelion and I hadn't laid our cards on the table at the start, I might have suspected he had a history with the alchemist. He spoke like a lovesick beau. In fact, he desperately wished to meet with him. Kalkstein's in Novigrad? Wouldn't mind seeing him myself. You're too late, I fear. The witch hunters nabbed him recently, burned him at the stake in Hierarch Square. But as he perished, ooh, the goings on, impressive. Fiery beasts circled his pyre, then rose into the sky and exploded to form letters. Whoa. Really? What did they spell? Radovid sucks flaccid cock. <laughs> Thanks for your help, and uh, nice to meet you. I can help with much more. If you need new trousers or a vest, you know where to find me. Thank you. Talk to Maravilla. <laughs> hey, look! <laughs> the little door. <laughs> Where are they going? <gasps> oh, can I kill a pig in the city? Okay, before I do, I'm gonna save it just in case I get shot by the guards or something. Don't say anything. Oh, there's a lot of shops. Oh, a barber. What is it, great boy? Looking for adventure? Who's crying? No, no. Excuse me, I'm looking for Marabella. I am she. Wait outside, class is in session. I'll wait. <laughs> It won't take Oops. long. It turns out he'll not come after all. Why not? A rat bit him, and he's caught a fever. Where'd he get bit? It hurt him much. <coughs> Will he die? Don't die from rats, stupid. Yes, you do. Just the other day, I saw a witch hunter tell a man, you rat, and then he killed him. Liar, that's enough. We're done for the day. Gather your things and go home. I wonder if the rat catcher will get well. Like as not. How do you know? Mum says that if he but catches a cough, he's as good as he's a This one's got to Will you help? Excuse me, sorry. 
Okay, where are you, lady? Now can we talk? Yes. What do you want? I know you saw Dandelion recently. Oh, yes. Longest afternoon of my life. He read you his poems. No. <laughs> he perused the illustrated guide to fungi. Hmm. Maybe... No. Won't even try to guess why he wanted to do that. I'm old. <laughs> that was his interest. When his hand abandoned my knee to point at a figure of penicillium, I knew the fire between us had died. Permanently. See Dandelion after the fungus incident? No. <laughs> I even considered granting him another chance. His heart of hearts is pure gold. He simply needs a bit more discipline in his life. But he never came back to see me. So I thought if it's done, it's done. Hmm. Thanks for your help. Farewell. Well, she seems nice. My uncle's in the circus because he can swallow swords. Can you? Can you? No, I can't. You look familiar. My strength's gone. Whoa. My eye on you. Put it in your bunghole. This baronet's love of Let's Villa. Shouldn't interest you. The baroness don't mingle with just anyone. Don't worry. I'm here to see your chambermaid, Molly. Out of the way. Baroness is riding now. Be gone. Hmm? Greetings, Witcher. Must admit it's curious to see you here. I don't quite believe in coincidences. Geralt of Rivia. Slayer of monsters. And my son. Your son? You're right, General. My visit's no accident. I'm looking for someone. There's no one here who wishes to see you. Captain, this man is not to enter. What is she such a friend, rude lady for? I've lost my appetite for the races. Why are you mad at him? Kill a woman's son and appear at her doorstep. Oh. My, my. I thought witches had better survival skills than that. Looking for a girl named Molly. Heard she works here. I fear your information's out of date. Molly no longer works here. She get fired? Baroness fired her. Quite the contrary. Molly decided she no longer wished to serve. After Arian's demise, Luis's nephew came to pay his respects. Hmm. Got one clance of Molly and, well, they wed soon after. They now await his inheritance. With the Paranus's son dead, the estate will go to the nephew and Lady Lata, known until recently simply as Molly. Gotta wonder if Molly fell for the nephew or his inheritance. We cannot know that just yet. But by the way, she has strong feelings for both. All right, so where will I find the newly minted Lady Latar? Our dear little Molly has a new passion, horse racing. To my knowledge, she should be at Countess Vagelbud's villa right now. That's exactly where I'm going. Since you stripped hmm. me of Louise's company, perhaps you'd agree to come along. 
Well, if Molly will be there. On our way then. We've arrived. Nice place. I must say, of all the creatures in this region, I find steeds most intriguing. Horses interest you at all, Witcher? All the same to me. Call each one I ride Roach. Strange. The Grey is Cantarella, sired by Cahir, the champion from Vol. Yeah. Grey is a good color. Even looks good on horses. My coins on the Black Stallion, Nemrod, purest Nilfgaardian stock. Surprised he didn't salute you, General. Hmm. Seem to know your horses. I find them to be far more honest than men. Must say, I'm curious how you manage in the saddle, Witcher. Mostly just try to stay in it. <laughs> what would you say to a little race? Not what I came here for. Don't make me beg, Witcher. Tell you what, win, and I shall give you my finest saddle, made in Nilfgaard proper of beautifully tanned leather. Hmm. Why not? Wouldn't mind seeing if your knowledge of horses translates into riding skills. Ha! <laughs> Splendid! In that case, you must choose a mount. Hmm. Danian chestnut looks promising. In that case, I shall try my luck on the Zeracanian Bay. The horses are saddled. Let's begin. Hmm. Hey, hey. He's going to win. Don't spare the horse. Hey. Hey. Come on, Witcher. Let's see what you're made of. I am. Ah, oh, come on. Oops. Stupid horse. Ah. Uh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, come on. I'll block him from going. Whoa. The roach I chose put in a nice run. Exceptional. I've not lost a race in a while. I congratulate you. That is yours. Nice. Ah, look. Lady Latar has just arrived. Who? The woman formerly known as Molly. There she stands. Right. Thanks. I shall be here for a time. Find me if you'd like to ride back to the city together. Cool. Hey, lady. I need to talk to you, lady. Who do you favor, my lady? Can't decide between the black stallion and the grey mare. Keep going back and forth, back and forth. Sorry, don't believe we've been introduced. 
I'm Geralt. Geralt? That Geralt? The one Dandelion's rescued time and time again? Rescued? That's right. Except it's the other way around. I'm always saving him. Mean to say it weren't Dandelion saved you in Flotsam by severing your noose with an arrow from an hundred paces? What? Dandelion? <laughs> <sighs> Never mind. Any idea where our master archer might be at the moment? No. Sadly, I haven't got a clue. We've not seen each other in ages. Ever since I became Lady Latard, she has a pretty dress. Balls, banquets, and other such. She has a nice, oh, pretty it? necklace. Congregations. Awful tiring, all this. But. <laughs> Or maybe his sister could help you. Such a nice girl. What? You do realize Dandelion doesn't have a sister? Sure he does. Saw him himself. Funny, she don't look like him at all. Blonde, for starters. Maybe they're different fathers. Mm-hmm. Different mothers, too. <laughs> maybe. But you could see he cares for her. Looks after her. The way he carried her packages and... Know where I can find her, Dandelion's sister. I know. Whenever I ask Dandelion when we visit her, he'd grow all quiet and then change the subject. Any chance you remember your last conversation with Dandelion? Of course. He came to borrow some coin for a barge. What? Why do you need a barge? To take me on a romantic cruise of the canals by the light of the moon. Said there'd be strawberries and that wine with the bubbles and <laughs> sing me arias. Aria. I'm under the impression Dandelion thinks you still serve the lavalettes. Oh, that's because I never told him I stopped. Didn't want him to treat me any different. And your husband has nothing against it? Your old friendship? Of course not. Sweetiekins couldn't be happier that Dandelion's raising me sophistication. What? Thanks, Molly. Wait. Before you go, I've got a request. And what is it? Dandelion told me once he'd show me his etchings, but he never did. I'd so like to see him. Won't be too hard to convince him. He loves showing off those etchings to anyone he can. That's wonderful! Thanks! And good luck to you on your search. Alrighty. Oh, whoa, whoa. Yes, well, well, another freak. Uh oh, another I got too much stuff. Uh oh. Okay. Uh oh. I gotta drop something. Oh boy. Hopefully that helps. Still? Oh man. Never mind then, pick it back up then. <whistles> I gotta go sell some things then. Come here. Okay, why are you not letting me get on?
Another one. Run along home with the rest. Sir, show some mercy. We've not got nowhere to go. For us, it's Novigrad or death. Had enough for you, lot. Sod off, or I'll have you skewered. <laughs> they seem desperate. Let them through. Can't see any harm in it. Fucking hell. How many times have I got to repeat this? I've orders to turn back anyone who don't show a pass. King's a long way away, and your pay's probably meager. Sure we can't make a deal? I mean to say you're looking to, um, <clears throat> purchase a one-time pass? Exactly. Ah, uh, that's a whole other conversation. Way's clear. Cool. Thank you. We got nowhere to go back to. Novigrad, that's a chance of a new life. Stay off the roads. Liable to run into another patrol. Shan't be taken like that again. We'll be as careful as hares in a field bared by winter. But you, you was cast in a different mold than us. More like the hero that lies in the tomb near Crookback Hills. Tomb's in a cave in a hillside. Down Warren's at the foot of the hill. Folks say treasure inside's a sight to behold. Huge hoard. Might find something that suits you. Good luck. Wouldn't be so pale if you ate onions and oil. Onions and oil. Hopefully there's a merchant by Hey everybody You'll choke to death on three pounds of steel. Well that's not very nice. I wonder if the bartender will buy anything from me. Catito Get out of the road! Whoa, whoa, whoops. Whoa there, Roach. Would you be keen on helping me with a very important matter? What is it? Whoops, sorry. I didn't mean to do that. No, get off. I meant to dismount. Sorry. Oops, almost ran over you, little guy. What are you talking about, little guy? Actually, you know what? I shouldn't. Oh, I what did. Oops. Name's Muggs. Rost and Muggs. Need your help in a grave matter. What's this grave matter? I came here on business. Sadly, just there across the river. Toward the bridge's end, I was attacked. Smashed a bottle of the finest dwarven spirit on the bugger's skull. But the robbery was still a partial success. Tell me what you want already, and be brief. Thief ran off with my documents. Very important documents. I need you to get it back for me. It'll cost you. I don't work for free. That I know. Since the dawn of time, no witcher's lifted a finger without pay. I've a smatter in the coin in the soles of my boots. Return the documents, and it's yours. Fine. See what I can do. Might be my last chance. I'm out of ideas if this don't work. What is this? What's going on here? I hope there's a merchant somewhere. Oh, the brick makers. I don't 
don't want to have to drop anything. I'd rather sell it. It's making me walk slow. Ooh. Hi, Roach. Get up. Oh, good. Look, a merchant. Slower. Piggies. Come on. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna bump into somebody and they're gonna get mad. Merchant. Are you the merchant? Are you the. Shut off, ass much. What? What is it, Gray Boy? Looking for adventure? No. Oh. Ah, here we go. I just want to sell Greetings. you stuff, my friend. What have you got to pull? And how much do you need? What makes you think I need a loan? Taint a man that don't from time to time. And you don't look nor smell flush with coin. Just so happens I'm doing fine at the moment. Then maybe you'd like a look at what the less fortunate have forfeited. Show me what you have in stock. Okay. So... Huh. Okay, I don't understand. Huh. But what's this one then? Weapon and armor repair kit. Ah. Uh. Medium armor. Let's just sell this then. Oh, come off it. Come off it. Oh, what about this? Oh, you don't have it. You don't have enough money, but he did. So long. Okay, at least now we can run, right? Which is what I wanted. But I can't pick anything else up, so if I come off across another merchant, I need to sell something. What? They tried to talk, they tried to attack me. Talk to Rosa Varatre. Excuse me. Uh, watch it. You watch it. Uh oh. You catch him? No luck. Driving is slippery the bugger as quick as a tomcat. Scrambled out the hole in the Locked? What do you want? Need to talk to the person. 